Anybody out there in the YouTube mm-hmm. street? Where are you passing? Yeah, yeah. We're passing. Yeah. We're passing. What you do with passing? Yeah, mm-hmm. yeah. We're passing. What you do with it? Yeah. Right there. Oh, I just broke my comb, y'all. <laughs> oh, that's fun. That's fun. <laughs> <laughs> hey, Christy. Jean, this supposed to be Jeannie live. But she ain't got back from Montgomery yet. So Aiden, he, he laughed at me because I broke my comb. See his little head. Look, there you go. Tell hey, hey, tell Christy, hey. Tell hey. <laughs> He's trying to take over the live. So, I got to share myself out. Oh. Ain't nobody talking to you. Get down. Mama. <laughs> there ain't no mama. That's Christy. Mama. Say, hey, Christy. Get up from in front of the camera. Hey, BJ. Tell BJ, hey. Hey, everybody. Everybody. Say, hey, everybody. Tell everybody, hey. Uh-huh. Hey, lurkers. It's supposed to be, like I said, it's supposed to be Jeannie Live, but she ain't got from Montgomery yet. <laughs> yeah, Tanya. <laughs> yeah. Look at him. He's sleepy, y'all. Okay, I put him in some nighttime bath. Hey, boo boo. I put him in some nighttime baths, y'all. He'll be sleeping a little bit. Pull your, okay. Yeah, pull your pants on the bottom and look at your belly. <laughs> Sit down so you can watch cartoons. Sit down. Sit down. So watch Paw Patrol. He 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 gonna be watching Paw Patrol, y'all, and, and bother me. They keep messing with the top and all messages button today. I guess they can't decide what format to use. Oh, the top chat or the regular chat? <laughs> A hot mess. Aiden. Oh, come on, go night night. You gonna watch cartoons? Watch cartoons. Yeah, watch cartoons. He doing everything. Oh, okay. Mm-hmm. Watch cartoons. Watch Paw Patrol. There you go. Lay down and watch Paw Patrol. There you go. Mm-hmm. So what y'all been doing today? Uh, I hear in these streets. Move back. Mm-hmm. What y'all been doing? Um. Mm-hmm. It been busy. It been a busy. It ain't no more in here. It's been a busy day in these streets. Mm. Stop. So yeah, this is supposed to be um butterfly green fly. But I told her when she come, stop, boy. I told her when she come, she could get her live, and I'd be her co-host. Uh, uh. <laughs> Thank you, Susan. Getting ready for tomorrow, but still not ready. Oh, okay, yeah, for the for the uh the thing. What time does that start, Christy? Cause I got I gotta get on the road at 6 a.m. So I gotta get up at 5 a.m. And when I get him to sleep, oh 6 p.m. Eastern. So five. Oh, I'll be at home by then. No, I can't do that because I'm almost done though. I thought probably got I probably got like 
if Gene, if Jeannie hurry up and come on, get on here, sit down, boy, before you fall. Sit down, sit. Watch, watch cartoon. Um, yeah, I got, I gotta go to my niece' graduation. It's three hours away. Yeah. Ain't nobody talking to you. Mm. Ain't nobody talking to you. Mm. Ain't nobody talking to you. <laughs> <laughs> Ain't nobody. Yeah. Get off the camera. Really? Sit down and watch Paw Patrol. <laughs> yeah. We'll be back. We'll be back. We'll be back before then, before five. Yeah. Ain't nobody talking to you. Shh. Yeah. Get past, get past, get past. Hmm. All gone, all gone, all gone. All gone. Hmm. Hi, Wicked Granny. Wicked Granny, say hey, Aiden. Hmm. Look, they go, Granny. Say, Granny, D, hey, say, Granny, D, hey. Hey, Granny. Grannies with the S. Hey, grannies. <laughs> hey, granny D. Your bed is so full, you can't eat nothing now. He ate, he ate chicken tenders. He ate fries. He ate two tangerines by himself. And I ain't eating ice. He need to go to sleep. Hi, Don. <laughs> okay. This is supposed to be, like I said, it's supposed to be Butterfly Dream Genie Live. But she ain't got home yet. Your bed is showing. <laughs> and I gave him a bath and some nighttime bath. He ain't went to sleep yet. Where you pass it? Get past it. There you go. That ain't pass it. Uh -uh. You need to get up before five if you need to get him together and feed him no i'm gonna get up at five it's gonna be enough time because i'm gonna do everything i gotta do for myself tonight once he once i get him to sleep i'm gonna take a shower stop boy get past him you got past now lay down watch cartoon i'm gonna get i'm gonna um he don't look what because i just got i just got him out the tub probably like 20 minutes ago so he ain't nowhere near sleepy yet but he been crying he been crawling up on me he been crawling up on me and want me to hold him so i figure he's a little sleepy hi christy <laughs> so because y'all know i usually come i usually come live at 10 but since um cynthia ain't live i decided to come early plus um, Jean is supposed to be, this supposed to be her life, like I said. But yeah, BJ, I'm going to, I'm going to slide my hair up. Look, this is what I'm wearing. This is the ponytail I'm going to wear tomorrow. See that, you see that long hair back there? So I'm going to slick my hair up tonight, right? And then I'm going to wrap, wrap, wrap the thing on there, keep it on there, keep it slick back. Then I got to do a stick that on, and all I got to do is throw my clothes on. And, and throw his clothes on. Hi, besties. Who is the besties? <laughs> uh -uh. Mm -hmm. You better lay down. Where you going? What you, what you doing? Uh -uh. Uh -uh. Hey, Margie. Yeah, that's Chris. Yarn Barf is Christy. It's two Christies. Christy hooked hook me up with Christy, and Yarn Barf is Christy. Oh, okay. So, yeah, it's two Christies. <laughs> Uh, 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 you, you drop it. It ain't no more in there. Yeah. Hmm. It ain't no more in there. I think it's on in there. Wait. Let's see. Sit down right there. Sit down. 
I'm finna get my hook. Hi, Terry. Yes, I am, Terry. Thank you. Yeah, yeah. Hi to both Christies. <laughs> Stop, boy. Stop. <laughs> VJ, if I don't get done with it, VJ, I'm going to use that show now. Yeah, yeah. If I don't get done with it. Hey, Albie. I'm going to use that show. Thank you. Me too. I'm going to use that show now. Michelle made me. If I don't get done with my sleeve on time. Because I've been working on it, well, not all day, because I went back to sleep. I had got woke up early, and then I had went back to sleep. But when I got up, I started back working on it. What's down your tongue? Some hair? You got it? Got you some ice. <laughs> I'm gonna have him some breakfast, woman. I'm gonna get him some. He got some. He got some oatmeal in there. It ain't gonna take long to warm the oatmeal up. Oh, like I said, I'm gonna do all my stuff tonight. Then we gotta wait on my mom and dad to get here. So I'm gonna get him some breakfast. And then. I'm going to, um, after I get him some breakfast, I'll be waiting on my mom and dad to get here. So bad. You want this? But he good and full right now. Hey, Mar. What? Yeah. How's everybody doing tonight on this Friday night? Thank God it's Friday. Yeah, I got that one little piece of ice left, Aiden. Uh -huh. Hi, Angela, precious world. Pocket your, pack, pack your crochet. Well, I can't crochet while I'm, I'm waiting on my niece's name to be called. But I got I gotta drive. I was I was just to I just I was just hooked hooked me up crochet for about a year, but people was not knowing me then. I added my name. Now nah, okay. Yeah. All gone. Huh? Got one piece of ice left. Ah. You got one piece of ice left. Yeah. Huh? All gone. All gone now. All gone. Just had dinner. I was happy. It's Friday. I know that's right. I just had, I ain't too long had dinner either. Drina, you know I forgot to go downstairs last night and lock my doors. What? <laughs> what? Good, good. Nobody didn't try to come in. Just recorded a video and getting it ready to upload. I will have it uploaded later tonight or tomorrow morning. Oh, okay. Huh? I may start another channel with an easier, easier name. I'm thinking CH5 Laugh Out Loud. What? Give me my hook. Give me. Ah! Give me my hook. Get your, what your passing? What passing? What you did with passing? I told you not to mess with my yarn. Now what pass it? Where you pass it? No. No. What pass it? I ain't got it. What you do with it? Sit right there. Let me see if I find it. What you do with it? It's on this bed somewhere. What you did with your pass by? 
I don't know what you did with it. So here you go right here. Stands for five. <coughs> hey, Kelly. Get, come here. Get up here. What you did with that pasta? <laughs> I don't know what you did with it. <laughs> Hi, everybody coming in. <laughs> Kelly, that food show look good, girl. Today. Huh. I got it. I found it, Susan. You better keep up with this. Get that out of my do that side. Yeah, he 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 sleeping. He sleeping. Cause I I put him in some nighttime bath. I think I need about three more rolls and I'll be done. Oh. Yep, by three more rolls, I'll be done. Uh-uh. Yes, I will be. He talks, uh-uh. Yes, I will be. Hey, Nisi. I have a, I have a full baby now. Uh, uh, I have a food baby now. A hot man. Me and ate, ate chicken tenders and fries and and he ate two tangerines. Stop jumping with that in your mouth. No, no. <laughs> Don't jump with that in your mouth. No, no. Sit down. Sit. Sit. Now. Be good. Be good. Hi, Maribel. Hi, um, Miguel. How's it going, everybody? You a good mama, Drina. No, I'm a great aunt. That's my great nephew. <laughs> I don't have no kids. I think I right, 80. He said, yeah. <laughs> he's starting to, he's staring you down. He sure lives and look at him. <laughs> ain't I good auntie 80 ain't I good auntie yeah <laughs> he a hot mess that's what he is he only one years old he'll be two in November stop boy get what pet get she was sloppy sir yeah, Miguel, he always stare me down. I'm trying to go to give him to go to sleep. Yes, he's getting so big. Walking and if somebody cuss, he cuss. Whatever somebody else say, he say. So he he get a whooping if he cuss though. He laugh. Yeah, he do. He laugh at me too. He do. He really do laugh at me. There is a new type of broom out. It's sweeping the nation. I hot me. Stop kicking me, boy. Huh? You can go night night. You can go night night. Yeah. Oh, he said, uh-uh. Uh -huh. Yes, you is going night night too. Uh -huh. Night by life I lie. Yeah. Sometimes he can sometimes he joke be so corny. Let me see my baby. Aiden. Auntie Bunny want to see you. You tell Aunt Bunny, hey, tell her, hey. Tell her, hey. Tell Aunt Bunny, hey. Say, hey, Aunt Bunny, girl. Hey. <laughs> you ready to go to sleep now? You ready to go night-night? Uh -uh. Huh? Stop before you stick yourself in the eye. Huh? Stop before you stick yourself in the eye. Huh? Oh, my goodness. Get my yarn. Huh? Aiden, he said, she said, hey, Aiden.
Oh, you rub my eye. No, no, no. You better not do that. I'm going to take you. going to be hiding. Uh-uh. Yes, uh-huh. Uh-uh. <laughs> He's so cute. I love uh-uh. him. He love you too, Bonnie. What did the late tomato say to the early tomato? I'll catch up. <laughs> Can you come get him right now, Bonnie? Look at him. He's so sleepy. Because he usually don't lay around on me like this. So I know that nighttime bath is kicking in, baby. Hi, Vivian. Bunny been playing around, playing with him since he was a little baby. Come walk. She asked his dad and my nephew, can she have him? Hey. He's so he's so bad. He he ready to go to sleep though. I'm I'm going night by. What night by said? Hey, Angel Renee, how are you? He, yeah, he ready for bed. He ready for bed. Nightbot need to go to bed, and so do Aiden. Ain't that right, man? Give him a kiss for me. Okay, I will. Come on. Got to give you a kiss. Get kiss. Get kiss. Get kiss. Mwah. Ooh. That was for that was for Aunt Margie. She wanted to kiss. That was a nasty slobber kiss. Uh -uh. Yes, it was a nasty slobber kiss. Uh -uh. How, how you gonna tell me that was a nasty slobber kiss? Uh -uh. <laughs> Glad and good on our way home so I can check better. Oh, okay. Be careful. He gave me a slobber kiss, and then I say. You gave me that old slobby kiss. He said, uh-uh. Yep. Yep. Pills are kicking in. Look. Kick, kicking in for him, too. Look at him. He'll never lay around on me like this. My house used to be full of kids. Uh -uh. But now everyone moved away with kids. I miss having a house full. Oh. Bunny gave you a kiss, too. Mwah. Uh. 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 Stop. He's trying to crochet by yarn. Get out of my yarn. Stop. 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 Okay, prayers for the rest restful sleep, tank tanker, tankster. I hope you don't wake up on the floor like I did this morning. What? You rolled out the bed? I hope you, Boo Boo, I hope you have a good night's rest. You hurt your mouth. Let me see. Give me that. <laughs> Come here, let me see. Let me see. You hurt your mouth. It's okay? Okay, Bonnie. You fell out of bed last week, too? Whoa, my head, my my face hit the my drawer. I I had pulled out. Oh my goodness, y'all better be careful. Let Tita see. You got your passing. Get your passing in. Okay. Come on, you want to lay up here with Tita? Uh -uh. Okay. Uh -huh. Come on. Uh -huh. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Ain't no more juice. I, we drank it up. <laughs> huh. 
<laughs> He's drinking water, y'all. I banged my head on the chicken coop. What? Sandrine, I was going to say you were frozen till I realized. Wait, baby. Until I realized I didn't know to push. Ah! <laughs> you had to push the play button. A hot man. Yeah. Let me do it faster. Mm. Mm. Nope. No more. Go night. Nope. 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 Did you get a knot on your head? Miguel, are you okay? Go to sleepy baby. Come on, go to sleepy now. Go to sleepy baby. Go to sleepy now. Go to sleepy. Felt like someone hit my hit me with a two by four. Oh my goodness! Y'all better be careful out here. Falling out beds, hitting your heads on the crate on the on the thing. Uh, well, sit up right there and watch the TV. It's very rude. Awakening. Mm. Y'all gonna have to scoot to the middle of the bed so y'all won't roll out the bed. That's craziness. Chris, you crocheting tonight? Because I know you ate. Right before you went on careless. I'm trying to finish this. Um, I'm trying to finish this this uh sleeve while I talk to y'all. Make sure y'all check out Mars Mars. Uh, crochet channel, y'all. She's trying to get family members. Didn't you fall out of the bed last week? She fell out this week, too. Oh, Aiden. Oh, you stink. You smell like a grown man. Lay down. You little Spartacus. She said, Not last week, BJ, not her. Um, low crochet and laying low and crocheting, but I want to start a project for Mother's Day. Okay, go on, do it. Let us see it. Dang. Pop Joe, Pop Joe, Pop Joe. <laughs> <laughs> Chris, you trying to let one out? Hey, ew, 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 <laughs> ew. <laughs> oh, the only thing you can think about making is a rap. What's that? I love his little voice. He and him trying to he he and him trying to do. He trying to let it rip. He already let one rip. He stinks so bad. Hi, creep. I miss uh oh, Chris Christine. Hi, Christine. Hi, girl. Hey. If anybody want to come up, I'll drop the link. See about y'all look. Look, apple head. Uh -uh. Yes, you is. Uh -uh. Yes, you is. You need a seat belt uh -uh. to stay in bed. <laughs> uh -uh. Uh -uh. Uh -uh. Uh -uh. 
Run! Ah! Uh-uh, uh-uh, uh-uh. Don't do that. Huh? Don't do that. Uh-uh. Yeah, don't do that. Uh-uh. You're supposed to be watching Paw Patrol. Uh-uh. Yeah, he need he need to go to sleep. Look at him. Get out of no. Look, man. Ew. You ain't getting no more kisses. <laughs> Stop. We'll pass. Get your pass. Uh-uh. We'll pass it in. Put it in. There you go. Now go night night. Uh-uh. Stop. <laughs> he like to he like to pull my ear when he get ready to go to sleep, y'all. Uh-uh. I sleep in the middle of a king size bed. Uh-uh. So I shouldn't fall out. You sure shouldn't? Uh-uh. I sleep in a queen, I don't fall out. Ooh, that sound nasty. Uh, that sound nasty. Uh, uh, you should do too. Why you can't get the other ear on the other side? Uh, uh, Cause you don't want to. Uh, uh, I'm trying to crochet, y'all. He laying on top of my crochet. You look. Every time he come over here, he lay on top of my crochet. Every time I try to crochet. Every time. No, I've been falling out. No, I've not fallen out yesterday. <laughs> Dang, who fell out yesterday? Some people fell out today. If I fall out, I might hit my head on something other than a... I might hit my head on a dress or draw. Leave just alone. <laughs> So what everybody been um doing today in these streets? Easy to explain. A hair ends up in your crochet, but not if you find a kid in your crochet. <laughs> he been laying his head on the crochet, his body. This I have my hair look like this because he keep pulling it. He like to pull my hair and play with it while he get ready to go to sleep. Got his foot on my back right now. Yeah. But uh, I'm going to slick it back before I go to bed tonight. We have a king size bed. But I'm always, but I always sleep right on the edge. I don't know why. I, uh, uh, I sleep like in the middle of my bed. I got a queen size. I got a queen size bed. Hi, Kimberly. How are you? Here we go night night. Come on. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, see him. He he ain't let me rock and he jump it up. <laughs> I used to Mara, but since my husband died, I ooh, I moved to the middle. Boy, you better settle down. Settle down. I spent the entire morning, afternoon. Morning and afternoon outside working on my garden. Came in at 3 p.m., got cleaned up, and started crocheting on my heirloom blocks. I'm almost caught up on block number 48. Okay. Hi, Wally. 
two more to go and I'll be caught up in the cab. All right, girl. Get it, girl. Wally, what you working on? Yeah, Nisa working hard, baby. I'm gonna I'm gonna do me a garden, but I'm gonna have to put mine in buckets because we got dog, we ain't got dogs, but I never got dogs, got husky dogs. Mm -hmm. I just got my package from Bree. Get it, girl. And um yeah, Wally be, Wally be high now. She don't be coming in these streets no more. She said she'd be over there at TikTok. But, um. I got to check Gina and see if she back in town yet. I ain't no cotton. I ain't no cotton yarn like this. The soft cotton. I ain't know I get tangled up like this. Yes, I am. Thanks for all y'all prayers. I am feeling a lot better. The mucus starting to move and everything. I don't want to cut my. You know how you. I I always want to cut the acrylic when it get tightened up like this. But my cotton yarn, I don't want to cut it. You got the, I usually say, you got the cut it, but I don't want to cut this. Let me see. Okay, I think I got it. I think we going to see. I got to get, I got this much more yarn left. I got a lot, lot, lot left, but it look like this. So, what's everybody drinking and working on this time of night? I'll probably stay on here till 10. Mm -hmm. After I get this little bundle of joy over here sleep, then I can do what I need to do to get ready for tomorrow. Because this is a three-hour drive. He'll be sleeping in the back seat the whole time. But the nighttime bath, I'm telling y'all, I ain't put them in the baby nighttime bath. I put them in the nighttime bath that I use for myself. So it's stronger. So guess what? It's going to be out. He winding down. But I had got it. I had got it when I had got sick. And um, I wouldn't get no sleep. And I had got it and I had bathed in it. Um, and it helped me sleep. So the night when he came, he was so hyped up. Um, I want to put him in it because he is, it seemed like it ain't working no more. H2O and a dish rag. Reese, Reese, dish rag, Reese supply. I'm drinking blueberry tea. Okay. Oh, I was drinking water, but I need to get me some more. What state are you locating? I'm in Alabama. I roll with the tide. Yep. I'm in the little old Alabama. So I'm working on this. I got to go to uh, Mobile. Um, yeah, I got to go. to. I'm in Tuscaloosa, but I got to go to Mobile for my niece. She graduating tomorrow. She getting her master's. So I she already graduated one time. I'm like, girl, we already went down here last year. Now we gotta go down there again this year. But it's all good. <laughs> so so are you? I'm um I am central, central time. I usually, uh, Mar, I usually go to, I usually go live on Friday nights from 10 o'clock until whenever I get tired of being on there. But, hi, Joy. But since I, but, hi, Maritza. Thanks, Nisi. I let her know 
But since I um got to get up so early in the morning, um, Jeannie's butterfly dream, Jeannie said she was gonna go live around this time. And since she hadn't made it back in town yet, she said told me to go ahead and go live and she'll let me know when she stop, boy. Lay down. And she'll let me know when she get home so she can um go live or come up here or But if anybody want to come up, you can let me know you want to come up. Well, I'm trying to get Uncle Fester over here. Bless his OBW. Yeah. Look. Look, OBW. Look. Um, look, Aiden. Tell OBW, hey. Tell OBW, hey, Aiden. Tell, hey, girl, hey. Come here. Come here. Come here. <laughs> he was. Ah. He was over here trying to nod out. Ah. Uh uh yeah, I usually go at I usually go at ten p.m. and uh don't get off until yeah like I so I'm ready to get off. Lay down, watch cartoon. Look, watch cartoon. I'm trying to get him to sleep. OVW. He trying to. Uh, Joyce said, "Hey, Aiden. <laughs> Look at him waving. <laughs> he one years old." He'll be two in November. He my great nephew. Okay, y'all, I'm back. Bye, Ma. Six. You got to be here at six in my house. Six. Six. Oh. <laughs> Yeah. Oh, he's so bad, y'all. Hey, Sandra. Boy, he's smart. He's smart for one. Yes, he is. Already talking. He say bye. He say hey. He say uh-uh. He said mm-hmm. And sometimes if you say wrong word, he'll say it word too. Uh -uh. Yes, you will. Uh -uh. Yes, you will. Uh-uh. Mm -hmm. Move out the way. Uh -uh. Do other way. Come on, lay down. Ah. Huh? Come on, lay down. Hmm? Come on, lay down. Hmm? Hmm? Uh -uh. He watching Paw Patrol, y'all. Hmm? That's his jam. Uh -uh. OBW, you gonna do a live Sunday? Uh uh. How you know? Yeah. How he know if she gonna do a lie? You in her brain? Uh uh. Huh? Uh uh. Well then, you don't know then. Huh? Joy, what you working on? Sandra, what you working on? Are you feeling better? I know you wasn't feeling well. I can't wait for my grandbaby to get here. I'm 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 gonna spoil it. You gonna spoil it? You gonna spoil it? That's how this one is. Uh -uh. Yes, you are for. Uh -uh. Uh -uh. Uh -uh. Yes, you are. Uh -uh. Oh, okay. I should. Yeah, I will be back. I will be back home to watch. Um, tomorrow. Well, Sunday. I I'll, I'll be back tomorrow evening, but I'll be back to watch. Um, I'll be back to watch. Um, Sunday. Mm. 
I'm working on a baby blanket. Oh, I got to work on one of them. I got to make a little boy's baby blanket uh, for one of my cousins. I'm doing okay working on another throw for a donation. But you changed the TV. You finna get a whooping. They gonna see you cry. Uh huh. Uh-uh. 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 What are you passing right here? Uh-uh. Yes, uh huh. Uh-uh. I'm fading fast, y'all. I'm worn out. I am. Good night, Nisi. Lay down. Whoop it. Lay down and watch cartoon. Uh. Oh, my legs. My leg went to sleep. Hey, Rochelle. How are you tonight? Look, I want to get me some of these so I can make bags. Look at these. These fat quarters. From Walmart. Lay down. I see it. Lay down. So I went and got some of these fat quarters from Walmart yesterday. Of course they purple because that's my favorite color. Stop it, baby. Look. What are you passing? Yeah, purple. You better be trying to keep up with your passing. Get out of my mouth. You little nasty vermin. Yeah, my color. That's how I ch- put, changed the sheets on my bed today, so I put on my purple sheets. We'll pay, get past it. <laughs> Stop. I'm going to give you your... Um, Mm-hmm. Hmm. I'm gonna give you your medicine. Mm-hmm. That's what I'm gonna give you your medicine. That was uh, that was that was a good deal on these. I said I'm gonna go back and get some other colors. Mm-hmm. Aiden trying to play with these right now. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Some other variety for some good. In- yes, I'm a, when I make my bags. So I'm gonna stop getting the plastic bags from the grocery store. I thought I was going to have to go to the hospital. Woo, it was horrible. I think I had a sinus infection plus a cold with it. So it was rough on the sister. I had a fever and everything. Good. Just got home from a stitch group. Love the purple fabric. Uh-huh. I'll make me some, um, I'm going to stop getting the plastic bags at, 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 at the, at the uh, grocery store. Hi, Nancy. And I'm going to use my. Well, that, wait, let you get it off of me. Mm. And, um, to, and to line bags with. Oh. All right, Drina, got to get ready for extreme devotion. Have a blessed night. You too. Uh-uh. You shouldn't throw it down there. You shouldn't throw it down there. I think I'm. I, I got some in my cart. I got some in my cart. My Walmart cart. So it got a lot of different varieties, but it had pink in it. I was like, mm. but I mean, I can always put it, give it to somebody because. Mm. Get the My hmm. Okay, lay down. Hmm. 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 Lay down. It's Sandrine's connection. Oh, my connection messed up. Stop, 
It don't act right when I um. Mom. Is it better? Mom. Mom. You know what? You finna get it. Mama. Get your pencil. Mama. Get your pencil. For some reason, I have to take I have to take the uh, Wi-Fi off. Let me stop your pet. I have to take the Wi-Fi off for the act right for some reason. <laughs> it was so bad. Oh, thank y'all. Yeah, yeah, yeah. For some, I don't know why Wi-Fi won't act right on here, but every time. It does that every time. So EJ, what you working on? Oh, you just came from somewhere. So I know you ain't working on nothing. Marissa, what you working on? <laughs> I'm about about ready to sing Hey Jude with all those bears. Hi, Ola Joe. Old Joe is eight, and I'm trying to get him to sleep. <laughs> hey, baby hand and chat. <laughs> he like to pull my hand in my ear when he get ready to go to sleep. Oh. <laughs> he playing in my ear right now. <laughs> um, that's gonna be me. In about an hour, what sleep? <laughs> Stop. Uh, 80. Ola Joe said, Hey, Aiden. You gonna tell her, Hey? Look, look right here. Tell her, Hey. See, look at him waving. <laughs> uh -huh. Now, come on, let's go sleep. Uh, oh, okay, putting your boys to sleep. He like to sing. He like to sing himself to sleep. Uh, uh, you want to lay this way so you can see Paw Patrol? Okay, watch Paw Patrol. Uh, uh, so yeah, all I'm doing now, y'all, is rocking a little baby to sleep. And uh, he like to sing. He like to sing uh, when he get ready to go to sleep. You entertained. I usually be having more fun than this. Be laughing and janking and joking. But 
He want me to hum so he can hum so he can go to sleep. Ain't that crazy? Mm Can you pop up so I can get him to sleep, please? Won't you say you love me? I love you. You love me. We love you. Hey, Cindy. Big big hug and a kiss for me. Well, at least he got the, the other ear. Mm-hmm. Okay, thank you, Sunita. Mm-hmm. Just don't let him get to sleep. <laughs> Can you guys hear me okay? I can't hear. How's everybody doing? Hi, Rochelle. Oh, she, she muted it, so now I'm listening to myself talk. How is everybody doing? Okay, perfect. Hi, Kimberly. I know, it's growing so long, but it's so stick straight. Hi, Chris and Chris. Hi, Margie. Um, and it's super thin. It's so pretty. Cindy, hi. <laughs> I was watching the little baby chickens over at um, Mad Mimi's while I was crocheting this. I'm like, who else is on? <laughs> he fell asleep. <laughs> See, he like to, he, I like to, I sing, I love you, you love me. And then he'll hum with me while he hold my ear and he'll go to sleep. One did. Well, I I saw one flapping around. But yeah. I'm like, oh, I hope somebody's going to come up so you can hold the chat down while I get him to sleep. Yeah. I just got home. Honestly, I was going to try to stay off of YT and catch up on my shawls, but I couldn't stay away. No. I'm crocheting um, uh, Wishing on Dandelion. It's Spring's uh, Crochet Along from last month. I'm on row 10 right now. I thought you were humming this old man till you said 
No, yeah, it's Barney's song, yeah. Yeah. I was singing it, trying to sing it low so he'll hear me. And once I start singing, he starts singing it too. He hum it and I sing it. And then once I get through singing it, I hum it. Then he hum it with me. And then he go, he grab my ear, he go to sleep. He knocked out. My laying down. Yeah. But yeah. You know, you know they're supposed to be Jeannie live, don't you? Yeah, where's Jeannie at? I don't know. She texted me, she say, told me to go ahead because she hadn't she would leave her and her husband went to Montgomery for something. Oh. <laughs> Maybe I can crochet my sleeve. So will that be done by tomorrow morning? I'm hoping it's going to be done tonight. I need like three more rows. Hi, Ola Joe. I'm mm -hmm. excited to see your um, trip tomorrow. Huh? huh. She's going to a, a, a craft fair, right? Or what is it that you're going to? Yeah. yeah it is. is. <laughs> this old man. I started saying that to him, but he he's so used to the Barney song. Cause ever since he's been a baby, I sang that song to him when I get ready to put him to sleep. Yeah. So I don't think nobody else do it for him. But I do it. I do it every time. But I knew he was gonna go sleep early because like I said. Yeah. You see what Gina said? Send Gina the link to her page. Uh let me see. Um, yeah, um, be back back. Need to check the stove. Okay, Sandy. And, um, be right back. Okay. And Cindy said, um, I meant Cindy. Maryland Sheep and Wool Festival in West Friendship, Maryland. Okay, girl, have fun. Find some good stuff. You see something purple I might like, but if it ain't in a hank. Oh, did I send it to the right one? I don't know. Let me see. Well, I can't see if you sent it to the right one. Oh, no, not that one. Oh. But, but she can get it from there. She can get it from there. I sent it to her page. Hey, hey, Jen. Hi, listening till I drop out. Oh, I know, right, Jen? She'll get it from there. BJ, hey. Go ahead. Whoever in Maryland better go to that festival, baby. My royalty's here. Hi, royalty. Yeah. Royalty. I got this new yarn. You gotta stop calling yeah. her royalty because royalty is purple. Royalty is royal blue. <laughs> we'll look for you. Okay, Ola Joe. Wait, who's still but going? She going? Yeah. When, yeah, but she said, we'll look for you. Who's going? I asked her if she sees some purple yarn, pretty purple yarn, long as ain't no Hank. Oh. Put some stuff, I send her the money. <laughs> Angel Renee, hi. Hi, Pam. Oh, this is a, there's a guest. Has she is fun. here, y'all. This is her live, y'all. I'm gonna do Hi, me and Sunita. I'm gonna do me and Sunita like this. Oh, my, put her my over earpods here. are not even working. What the heck? Sunita, put her over. Put us on the side. Oh, hold on, mate. Put Gina right here in the middle, and put me and you on the side. I'm tired. What you had to go to my girl? Middle. Girl? No, don't put me in the middle. <laughs> what the crap? <laughs> the earpods didn't even work. Gina, you just missed your baby. I just knocked him out. Look. Look. I see. He been playing on here all along, talking to everybody, laughing, telling them, hey, blowing kisses. He's been doing everything. I'll be back. Okay. Ola Joe says she's packing right now. Everybody's going out. I'm staying. I'm tired. We stay, I'm gonna stay. I'll say I'm gonna stay on here to 10, but I'll stay on here to Jeannie get ready to get off. Yeah, 
I forget how working full time hours. I didn't know it cotton. drains you. Look, I did not know cotton tangle up. I didn't. Yeah. I ne never knew that. I had to so you remember that lady that you showed me on Instagram? What lady? Oh, that's that's that that yarn. That yes, yarn. Did too much yarn. You got too small from her. I got. I ordered this one. Her mystery box. Ooh, let me see. Hold on, let me take it out. Okay. I'm not going anywhere. I know that, right? We ain't going nowhere either. <laughs> What new yarns need to look? It's Ooh, that is pretty. It's called um Ooh, look at that pretty yarn right there. You only got one. Well, it's a mystery pack. Oh it okay. was her March mystery. Yeah, my color thing. It's there like pretty. It's teal Ooh. and purple and blue. With Ooh, that is so pretty. Pack. But I think I'm going to make Jen's little project with this. Oh, okay. She hey, everybody me... in the house. Yeah, and it's so soft. Everybody liking it. We just got home. We're going to go live tonight, but late for everyone else depends on those kids. Oh, okay. Oh, okay. That's pretty. <laughs> yeah, but look, she gave you candy. Uh... A tape measure. Yeah, girl. There was tea in here too, but I gave that to the Correct lady at work. Oh, okay. And it comes with a little stitch marker. Everybody liked it. I went to Joanne's today. Oh, Anything what good? you buying? I didn't buy no yarn. What you bought? You see my look, look what I found. Look what I found at, at my at, uh look what I found at um uh, Walmart. Back yeah, corner. They, mine had them too. How much were they at yours? I think that was one one something. For all five it? of them? What? Mine seven something for all of them. I don't think it was seven something. It might have been seven something. <clears throat> It might have been seven something. I'm gonna show you what I got. Uh oh. So need make you solo on me. I'm getting it all out the bag now. You and your husband went to Montgomery. Yes. Oh, okay. Yeah, when if you if you're into um needing fabric, I gotta go. I gotta go to I gotta go to Montgomery Sunday for the meeting. Me and my mama. And uh look at the um for the meeting. Yeah. What meeting? The meeting me and Gene me and uh Gene is supposed to have went with B. Oh. oh it starts Sunday? I don't I don't know when her start. No, I think it started today, actually. Okay. If you're in, in the need of fabric for anything, go to Joanne's. Oh, and yeah. They got this fabric. Look at their remnants. Their Clarence remnant um, yarn. I mean, fabric. Look at this one. Ooh. Well, how much? He's on it. $5.99 a yard. It says one yard, $5.99. And this is one yard, and I paid 80 some cents for it. What? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm going. I'm going. I'm going I got to that one. I got this one for 80 something cents. And this one is one yard. And all of this is 100% cotton. I'm going. I'm going. I'm going this weekend. <laughs> this one was is a half a yard. And I got it for 60 something cents. Ola Joe said that's a steal. Yes. And I got this one. This one was two dollars and something. Regular $9.99 a yard. And I got it for two dollars. 
And it says it's a yard, but I believe that's going to be more than a yard because that's kind of heavy. Paw print stars. They already got it. They already got it. Uh, it already comes like this. Okay, okay, okay. Hey, yeah. Iris Perez. Hey, Welcome. Iris. Hey, Iris. I got this one for $1.27. Nice. That one's mine, right? That's pretty. That's steel and purples. And it's 0. 0.72. Don't worry. We need, I'm going to get some, baby. My, my sewing machine going to be They had this all purple. Mm -hmm. I got it for a dollar. I think it was a dollar seventeen. Oh, you know I'm getting that. I'm, I'm getting me like two or three of that color. I actually want to open this, take the sleeve off of this one and see what it is. The print of it. I think it's going to be like a novelty. <laughs> it might be something bad. <laughs> uh uh. I hope not. Make sure y'all join Mara's family if y'all haven't already. Oh, Lord. They got that people in, in the there. building. Let me cut it because I don't want to mess it up. I just say it. This one I got for $1.47. And it's. Uh, a half a yard, but it was regular ten ninety nine a yard. Oh, it's cute. Oh, that oh, is flamingos. cute. <laughs> the flamingos on the beach. Mm -hmm. <laughs> That's the only kind of pink I take is the flamingos. That's cute. Yeah. That one is cute. I got this one for eighty seven cents, and it's a yard. That's a pretty color. Yeah, it's like a peachy. Now, this is a little bit thicker, but it still make a good bag liner. And it's water. Well, I, I paid $1.87 for it. <laughs> nice. Regular $6.97 a yard. I paid $0.87 cents for this one. I like that one, too. Nice mm -hmm. and simple and clean. Mm -hmm. Yep. This one I think is one of my favorites. It it's a yard. It says, "Make a good hat, big brim hat, that watermelon." Yes. And this one was a dollar eighty-seven. Oh, that's pretty too. It's gray and black. Mm -hmm. And this one is got glitter. What? It says Easter ombre eggs, but it don't look like eggs to me. Now this one was twelve ninety nine, and I paid a dollar eighty seven for it. And this one is it says a yard, but that looks like more than a yard. Oh yeah, they look more than like more than a yard. And it's Hi glitter. Rebecca, you see the glitter? Oh yes, I like it. And then this is a like a purple tie-dye. I paid Ooh, I like it that too. 67 cents for it. And then this one, I paid a dollar twenty-seven, regular ten dollars a yard. Oh, that's pretty. Oh, I like all the colors. Yeah, I don't know what other colors are in it. Let's see. Let's see. I hope I'm cutting this tag and not my fabric. <laughs> Oh, I see right here. <laughs> Look at that crazy joke. That's I know. Cool. I'm, I'm laughing over here. <laughs> His gold friend. <laughs> His ghoul friend. His, His ghoul friend. friend. Oh, yes. Look at that, y'all. Oh, that's so pretty. Got the, I don't like want to put that in the bag. Oh, yeah. I was well, I'm gonna do other things with them besides bag liners now. I was gonna say I'm gonna make some with that one. Ooh, shy. Yeah. I got a ladybug one for 80 something cents. Oh, ain't that cute? And for the most part, these are all this is almost a yard. So mm -hmm. if this is almost a yard, this is way more than a yard. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Look at that. You know what, Gina? At my Walmart had some fat quarters that was 75 cents. I got the black and red polka dot. Mm -hmm. 
Got the black and white polka dot. Okay. This one was like 40 something cents. And this one was like 40 something cents. And then I got this one. Ooh, treaty. It was a uh, regular $12.99 a yard, and I paid a dollar seventeen for it. And then this one, I want to open it up too to see because it's got a bunch of different like animals on it. Wildlife, I mean like ocean animals. Mm -hmm. And it was regular right ten nine ninety yard, and I got it for a dollar thirty seven. And I like it. Ooh, I like that. I like Crabs the little pieces and, fish. and the little crabs. Yeah. So I that's folded double. So that's oh, enough for more than one bag. Yeah, that's enough for a bag. And then on fat quarters, I got this one. They had these marked down to five dollars for a yard. Oh well, that's good. Yeah, and it's, got, it's got yellow. It's got it's called be happy. Oh, it's got bees on it. Bees happy. Be happy. Happy, happy, happy. When I told my husband I wanted to go to Joanne's, he said, huh? I said, not for yarn, for fabric. <laughs> That's what it looks like. Oh That's nice. Look what Chris said. And Joanne's had the <laughs> back quarter on sale for $1.47, which is cheaper than my Walmart. Because my Walmart, they're $1.77. Mm -hmm. Let me put these in here and I'll show y'all them. Okay. And I got some some of my. Lisa, if you were doing right, put it back in the middle. Hmm? Put it back in the middle. Oh. I got two in this color. I was trying to hide my face. Oh, that's cute. I got two in this color. Joanne's got it going on. Where you say you got these from? Joanne. Joanne's got it going on. Two in that. The blue lovers. <laughs> and I got this because I thought it was just as cute as the blue. <laughs> Look what your granny said. Oh, that's so cute. Oh, your peanut. I got some peanut butter and cam I just bought the other day. That's pretty. I got these two. Yeah, that's pretty up and then the pink. See, if I would buy that, it would just sit in a bag. And she'll end up sending it to me or Eugenie. <laughs> Mine ain't gonna sit in the bag. I'm gonna get my son. I mean, I do have my sewing machine downstairs. For my orange lovers. Oh. Or is it in the closet? I can't remember where I put it. Some well, if it's in the closet, then you, it won't just sit. Oh, that's pretty, too. See, when you get tired of crochet, you can sew. Blue lovers. That's nice. Yeah. I made me a head rag, a head rag with it. And purple lovers. Yeah. This, this girl. And purple lovers. Now this one I got three of. No, I didn't. I got two. Look. Blue. Yes, blue. Here y'all go. I That's like pretty. that. Mm -hmm. With the pop of yellow. yellow. Mm -hmm. Look, 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 look. Me, me, me. Me, you, and Jeannie. We purple lovers. And then I got three of these. Oh, now like that's, that. that's pretty. And you'll see that they're like different colors. Colors. That's pretty. But they're all the same. Baby, Joy loves soon, Paisley. Look, yeah. let me tell you, let me tell you, as soon as I get home from my, my niece's graduation, I promise you, as soon as I get home from my niece's graduation. Oh, that's pretty too. This is for your thread on clearance, $7. I got a lot of thread already put up. <laughs> it came in a case. I got it from um, I got the thread from uh, Amazon. This is what I really went for. 
Them Thank scissors. you. Scissors because I cannot find mine. No. Oh yeah, I forgot. I forgot. Okay, Marge. Marge said her too. And, and um, and I couldn't uh, find we'll this, so I got another one. Oh okay. I already had two with different um. Width in between each one, but I didn't. <laughs> I did not. No, ma'am. And I got me some black thread because I didn't have none, and this thread was ninety nine cents. Yep, I got mine from. I get mine from uh, Am, uh, uh, Hobby Lobby when it went on when they were marking everything down at time. Mm -hmm. I went in there and got cleaned up on black. So that's it. That's all I got. Yep, you will. Look, look what Chris said. You will find your pink and shears within a week now that you have bought some new ones. I probably will. They had these marked down to $18. So, and the ones that I can't find were like $30 something dollars. Whoa. Yeah. And I cannot find them nowhere. All right. <laughs> look, look what Rochelle said. Go check out their remnants because mine had a I'm whole lot of cotton. I'm going to Sandrine, mine. they had a roll of Auburn fabric too on clearance. Mm. I left it in the bin. <laughs> yeah, that's for the mother mm -mm. Look, I'm going to Mars. Yeah, well, I, I left it in the bin. Look, I thought I thought we get back to tea time. I'm gonna well, get my mom and them in there. One way go town, just go on over there to East Chase in Montgomery and go to Joanne's where I went. Well, you won't get none of this back. Well, look, let me tell you something. If my niece can tell me where the Joanne's at in Mobile, I'm going to go to that Joanne's on the way I home. I can tell you where it's at. It's on Airport Boulevard. Okay, well. Not too put... far from, from the university. Okay. Right, And it's going to be right across the road from um IHOP. All right, well, I'm about that line. I'll be I right up in there. The I can send you the address to it. Okay. That's the one I shop at when I go down there. Because Chastity and them stay right across the road from it. Oh, can you guys oh, hear what? him snoring? Huh? Mm -hmm. Hercules. He's on the oh, floor no. over here snoring. Oh. Hey, Nana Michelle. Welcome, welcome. Hey, Nana Michelle. Hey, Nana Michelle. Jen, yeah, that's it. Okay, now Michelle. Now, Michelle, you missed the bag. Other than yes. using it for lining bags, you're gonna have to wait and see what else I'm gonna do with it. Yeah, know, right. Oh, I'm gonna make a. I'm gonna make a lot of stuff. I love I hop strawberry syrup. I like the regular one. I can't have the strawberry. I like the regular one when it's hot. Ooh. Put it on your pancakes or your waffles. But I love these. I like peanut butter on my waffles. Oh really? My my nephews them like peanut butter on they um on they pancakes. I've only had it on waffles. I hadn't tried it on pancakes. Sandy, don't start. She said, I miss you all day, mama. You just come home and get on live. <laughs> <laughs> no, we've been home since right before eight o'clock, but we ate and I cleaned up the kitchen and I sat in the chair with her a little bit. Oh, this is that one. That that is pretty. Look. Oh, that mm. is. That's cute. Oh, I get to cut this off. But do not want to watch no more cartoons. Mm. But yeah, my fat quarters at Walmart are a dollar seventy-seven. I cannot believe they have gone up that high. From ninety-seven cents to a dollar seventy-seven. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that's high. I got some purple fabric in there. I was gonna make a shirt with. It. I'm still gonna make this shirt with it. No, I was gonna make a pillow with it. The bone pillow. Pancakes hurt. My stomach. That was a now. funny joke. Oh, we missed the joke. Pancakes hurt my stomach nowadays. Why can't your nose be 12 inches long? Because then it'd be a foot. <laughs> <laughs> and that's what that one looks like. Yes, I'm done with Paw Patrol for the night. No more Paw Patrol. 
He like Paw Patrol syndrome. Oh, yeah. And then he like me, when the song come on, he want me to sing it too, because I be acting crazy with it, and he just fall out laughing. He just think it's the funniest thing since sliced bread. Mm. Oh, yeah, you gotta watch it. Yeah, I had to watch it every time he come over here. Jeannie, she said something. Jenny, the squishmallows behind you crochet or knit. So my there and there. That is uh Mr. Purrs a lot from Chronically Crocheting. And they are crochet. She has a pattern for them. Or oh, you will be a Pinocchio. <laughs> yes, that's what I would say, a Pinocchio. Yeah. That would have on Chris had type laugh. Or that one is that that one's the cutest genie. Which one? The the flamingo one. Look. I found, I found out. out today that my fur baby that had surgery has cancer in her blood. Oh my goodness. We will be discussing more about it with the vet on Monday when we take her in to get the stitches out. Oh no, Miss Margie. So sorry to hear that. Well now which one is that? I did, Iris. I made them. Actually, they're both made out of um, Premier Puzzle yarn. And that one, if I'm not mistaken, that one's actually called Cat Cradle. And this one is um, Crossword. <clears throat> yeah, I made, I made both of those. She said the one that looked like Sandy. No, that she said yo, do her dog that looked like Sandy. Oh, sorry to hear that, Miss Marty. But you know what? From my understanding, Chihuahuas are bad about getting cancer. Mm. Oh, this is two pieces already cut. Oh no, it's solid here. Boy, whoever cut that fabric cut it crooked, didn't they? And wrong. And wrong. They must didn't follow the little groove in the cutting board at Joanne's that day. I'm telling you. One reason why I don't mind buying stuff like this because normally it's still cut straight. Mm-hmm. Lord, that's way off. Look down here at the bottom, Sandra. Oh, yeah. They, they know what they were doing. They probably miscut somebody's fabric and they were like, you might have re cut this. And they just put it over to the side. That was why you was in there. It's kind of... They cut it with their teeth. Iris. <laughs> Iris, you've been missed, baby. You so sure have. We miss you so much. Oh my I'm goodness, just that's too opening funny. up all of them to see how much I got. Huh. Let me find some special victims unit to watch. Nana Michelle, SVU Ooh. girl. I can give you something good to watch. Um, Outer Banks. What is it about? You know, yes. my sister told me to watch that. It is so dark. Let me tell you something when you start watching it. Well, I can't watch it tonight because I got to get up. I'll try to watch it tomorrow. I can't do it tonight because I might won't, won't get up in the morning. Yeah, you you can't stop. This got Joanne stamped on it. Christy, you missed all the good, all the good. Uh, you had to rewind a little bit and see all the good stuff Jeannie just showed us. Hey, Christy. Hey, Christy. They having they go having that thing for Kristen tomorrow evening. Oh, she is. Yeah. That fundraiser. Yeah. And what's it for? I know it's for Christy, but for what? Her her floor in her house. It uh about to pop cave in. 
Mm-mm. And so she having a fundraiser for the help get her floor dead. This one has shells and crowds. My daughter in law came in from crowds work, and all stressed. Oh, Iris, that's so sweet. I don't have a real foundation and my house is collapsing. You see that, Jane? What kind of house? I mean, how do you don't have a... You, you know the foundation up, of the house. You must be up off the ground. You must have a house that sits off the ground like a trailer sits up off the ground. Like an old, you know, the older houses that sit up on blocks, Sandrine. Uh huh. And they mostly have wood floors on the she inside. Yeah, she said, "Yeah, Gina." Yeah. Yes, yeah, off the ground. It's not a trailer, though. No, it's they. They houses were made like that back. Yeah, way you back. know, like sometimes in Florida they build them up off the ground because of the uh the water, the mm -hmm. water rises and stuff. Do you have a problem with water, Christy? My ex-husband built it with green wood from a sawmill. So the wood wasn't treated. Well, if it's green wood, it should have been. Shut up. I love leave. those old houses with the wood floors. Yeah. See, this and is more than a yard. Look, look um, Jean, what you say? And he only put one support and it twisted like a rainbow. Oh, Lord. He don't need to be building no more houses then. <laughs> he need to stop. He was young. He was too young and didn't know what he was doing. Well, he get an A for effort then. Mm -hmm. He get an E for effort. We're going to spell it with an E. Because <laughs> <laughs> it went quite right. She what she said? said? Someone else's problem now. <laughs> That's right. That's why he's got A. <laughs> we don't call them X's for nothing. <laughs> I ain't lying. Granted, he said on uh, who live we was on? Was it her live? No, we was on VJ Live. Nope, not VJ Live. She was on somebody live. She was like, I would like to meet, oh, Angela. She was like, I would like to meet all y'all husbands. I said, uh uh, not mine. Then she, not in person anyway. Look, she said, I already seen your husband, Sandrine, and he's a cutie pie. I said, what? Right. <laughs> what said, was that guy she talked about? What was uh -huh. his name? What was the his guy, name? The guy she talked about. I don't know, but he, she said he was a black man, baby. She couldn't start talking about it. Baby, she no, took what did she call him? That thing that you put your camera on? Tripod. Tripod. <laughs> tripod. I got, I got the messed up house. He got the messed up girl. Girlfriend, yes, I said meth. Ooh. Mm. Hey, karma. <laughs> hey, everybody in the chat, all you lurkers that ain't talking. Yeah, shut up. Hi. You're going to shut your mouth. She don't want to go out unless I go out. Oh, out the room. Mm. Ooh, that'd be nice for the next holidays coming up. Yes. yes. Hi, Aisha. Hi, Aisha. Hi, Aisha. Aisha, did you get winnings for me? He's glad he already ate. <laughs> oh, Don, I don't know. Is she on there now? Who? Somebody's asking about Don. She was earlier. She spoke.
You can take me off of the big thing now. I'm just. No, it's your show now. Uh, yeah, this will be your live anyway. <laughs> oh, my. How crazy for sure. I would much rather have the messed up house to deal with for sure, especially in my current condition. Laugh out loud. <laughs> Did y'all see Christy's video about the FedEx man? Uh uh. <laughs> Ah, Chrissy said FedEx. FedEx said they delivered her package. Chrissy got in her vehicle, went to her mailbox, <laughs> said, see, no package. <laughs> then she said, I'm going to drive y'all up to my driveway. Tell me they don't have room to turn around and all this kind of stuff. And everything. That's that watermelon. That is pretty. That is pretty. I want to eat it. And, um, she said, and I'm I'm fixing to go this way and where they could come and they could turn around. See, they got room to turn around. <laughs> they just don't want to do right. <laughs> what Krista was this? Yarn bar of Krista. Oh, she was on here earlier. She might have went to sleep now. I was laughing. I said, you get them, Christy. <laughs> Yeah, she was here earlier when I first came on. She was here. Her when and Christine. When did you come on? Huh? When did you come on? I came on at eight five hours ago. <laughs> an hour and thirty minutes, thirty-seven minutes ago. Ooh, I like that. I love ladybugs. Me too. I like the I like to catch them. As long as they're real ladybugs and not them. Justin, oh, she seen that video. Justin, she seen that video. Joy says she sent yes. <laughs> it was funny. <laughs> Good night, Pam. Chris Good night, Pam. I'm going to hear the bed. Good night, Pam. I don't know why they're making this my show. Because <laughs> you said you were gonna go live. Yeah, and my husband well it. It was supposed to rain here today all day. Yeah, it did. So, it ain't doing that. We was going to go to the neighbors and work today. And when he got up and checked the weather this morning, it said it was supposed to rain all day. He said, well, we'll go to Montgomery. We went to get light bread. And Elizabeth we, might be already. Elizabeth, Mama Riz might be already asleep. Yeah. It's already 10 o'clock. Don't even seem like it, do it. Well, I've been yawning left and right, so yeah. So, Jen, this is what I did to make the baby well, go to sleep. That's enough for one bag, Lana. This is what I made to do to make the baby go to sleep. I uh, I put him in the grown folk night, my nighttime bath, because I used it when I was sick and I couldn't get no sleep. So, I let him soak in the tub with it. With it. And now he out. Poor Aiden. <laughs> he ate good. I fed him. I fed him before we got in the tub. Then we got out the tub. I um put his night clothes on and socks. And then he ate two tangerines by himself. It's been humid and 90 here in Texas. Ooh, 90. We ain't got up to the 90s yet. We're supposed to get rain the next several days. We do too. We're supposed to get it starting tomorrow. Not here, we not. Not y'all here. Iris, that's just evil. What Iris said. <laughs> we used to do that to, we used to pull the little back off the lightning bugs and put it on our ears, make earrings, make rings. We were wrong for that, wasn't it? Yeah, you guys were. Well, that was back in the, that's back in the day we was in the, we used, the to wear we used to wear lizards for earrings. Well, I used no, to I burn the spiders no. <laughs> outside. You used to what? Burn them with the, the torch uh, thing. Gene, look what she said. Look what Krista said. Uh, why you got to specify light bread? Because that's really what we went when well, we went to go to Harbor Freight so he could get two tarps and some paracord. Hi, Michi. We literally was going to uh, Walmart and Pratt to get light bread. That's the only thing we were going for. A lot of people don't call it light bread. They be like, what are you, light bread? Light bread? 
I mean, like, you know, I'm like bread, sliced bread. No, we we got specific bread that we like. Like bread, yeah. And um, then he said he wanted to go back by Marshall's to see if they had that goat soap that he likes. Good night, Nana Michelle. And I told him I doubt it because Marshall's is like shopping at Dollar Tree. They get stuff they don't get it no more. Sunita, you see what Iris said? Yeah. They <laughs> Sunita, we but were spiders all... are evil with their creepy little legs. Oh, I like books. No, it's spiders. Oh, yeah. You know what? We used to get spider, them granddaddy spiders. We used to twirl them around and let them go. They used to be drunk. <laughs> the granddaddy, the granddaddy spider. Now the other spider we don't mess with, but the granddaddy spider with the long legs. We used to twist it around to get drunk and let it go. <laughs> we was a bad kid. And the last one. Well, you gotta find an area in your room. I used to play with Granddaddy. What's granddaddy. in that closet? Long leg Granddaddy, huh? What's in that closet? Mojo. You don't wanna know. Mojo. <laughs> I don't know what's in that closet. I ain't been in that closet in two years. You should have went in there when you would change your stuff around. <clears throat> that has to be my least favorite, but for 80 something cents, I wasn't passing it up. Look what Michi say, Jeannie. Jeannie, I shot my stash today and found two breezy skeins today. I'm ready to make that back. Oh, okay. Well, What's, I will do that. I'll do that tutorial Sunday. What's breezy uh yarn? The Karen uh funnel case. Oh. That's the I one in the blue. blue one. Yeah, it's the blue one. It's the blue, different color. What? TJ Maxx and Home Goods clothes. I got two of them. I think my, my Home Goods just got here. I know it ain't in the clothes. Mm. Thank yeah, you, Christy, Chris. we used to do that too. We used to tie a string to their legs and watch them fly. <laughs> <laughs> we was a bad kid. We had nothing else to do but go outside and play. And I used to sit out underneath the barn where it was real sandy at. And um, okay. I have a question. How do you have time to put string on their legs? Yeah, I put. We used to put string on the stink bug and twirl them around. Nice the bug. Yeah, and we'll keep the string on their leg and let them crawl around. They be dizzy. We let the string stay on their leg. When they get from dizzy, pick them up again and swirl them around. But they don't run away. Or fly away. How they don't get away? They got a string on the leg and we hold it. But how did you get the string on the leg? Hold it. Hold it leg. Ugh, I wouldn't touch it. <laughs> we used to catch them and put them in jars too. The lightning bugs. Yep. Never and let them out. And see them light up. Yep. <laughs> the, the, the stink bug by the ground. Nobody comes back as bugs nope. in their next life. And I used to, we used to chase my grandma up and down the, the late bank with night crawlers because she was scared. <laughs> now, I ain't do worms. I don't do worms. No kind. Well, honey, where we used to go fishing at, you just kick the leaves back and they go running like snakes. Oh, no. See. Yeah, no. They ain't that big. The little steak bugs ain't that big. Now I'm gonna tell y'all the worst thing that ever happened in in during my childhood. It was not me who did it. It was my brother. <laughs> and I promise you, he'll never do anything like that again a day in his life because he probably still feels that butt whooping. We was sitting at a store, and. We always had raggedy cars and stuff. We ain't never have no good vehicles or anything like that. We were poor. Yeah, we was too. And we were sitting at a store. And mom always kept, you know, pliers and stuff like that in the car. Just mm -hmm. in case it wouldn't crank. She'd get out and fool with battery cables and stuff. So we women knew how to do just as much as men did. So yeah. Hi, Chandra. My brother was sitting behind her. She was sitting in the driver's seat. My sister went in the store to, I think, was pay my grandma and them's barrel insurance for him. I think that's what it was. So we're sitting at the funeral home. 
all of a sudden mom starts hollering. I look over my brother and got them pliers, y'all. And done put it to her ear. <laughs> and was mashing on them and kept asking her, does it hurt? Does it hurt? Maybe I whoop his tail. <laughs> y'all, but she couldn't. She was in so much pain syndrome, she couldn't. But when she got when he got home, not only did she get him when he got naked and he got in the tub, my daddy got him too. <laughs> And wow. do you know her ear swole up huge and her whole ear turned blue and black? What made him do that? Sandrine, smart as I don't know what, but ain't got a lick of daggum common sense. He mm -hmm. asked, does it thunder during a thunderstorm? <laughs> That's crazy. And then he asked him, what was that white stuff and chicken crap? <laughs> and my mom and them told him it was ice cream. <laughs> that he could eat. He could eat just the white part. Oh my goodness! He has no common sense at all, but is smart as a wheel. Never had to study for a test. Never had to do none of that stuff. Just whatever they learned in the class, it was up there. Just don't give him no open book test. Yeah, he gonna fail it. Hi, Lydia. But yeah, clamp them darn pliers down on my mama's ear. Ooh. Hurt mama. I'm saying my mama like it ain't his mama. Hurt mama. I mean, she she was. She might have hurt my mama, but baby, we wouldn't have made it to the house because she would have got that car and took him out to her. She would have wanted to. Baby, my mama was crying. She oh, was Lord. crying. And then I was back there hitting him. I got a scar in the back of my head where he hit, clucked me upside the head with a hammer. Mm. Mm -mm -mm. And busted my head open. Mm -hmm. Your brother will hit you in the head with a hammer, you said? Yeah, he hit me in the back of my head with a hammer. Oh, uh-uh. When I was... <clears throat> I was four or five years old. Mom and them, Mom and them the one who told me about it. But I was four or five years old. Mm -hmm. And he did it. And mama said, when she asked him why did he do it, he said he was trying to kill me. <laughs> <gasps> and um, You and him was the only two kids? No, we're the last two of four. Oh. It's four of us. Oh, okay. I got an older brother and older sister. And then it was it's Keith, Dawn, then Rodney, which is the one that hit me in the head with a hammer, and then me. I'm the baby. Hey Kim. Hey Kim. Look. Uh, hey Kim. Gita found, Jim, Gita found some um Auburn fabric at your store, yo, Joanne's and Montgomery. Kim and Kim ain't Kim good little ways from Montgomery. Oh well. Well Ivy's though. Ivy, Ivy ain't gonna go get it though. <laughs> no, Ivy rolled tied, baby. Yes, you roll with the tide. <clears throat> I left it on the shelf too. I didn't care if it had not been cut it. I didn't care if it had been 10 cents. It's not past my shoulders, it's right at my so shoulders. But well, you coming here. I need look, to get look, it. Jenny, cut look. 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 Erase that Or ego. <laughs> remove that comment. Somebody remove that comment. Please that remove it. Like, remove it. We give you permission to remove it. <laughs> And y'all, Monday, we're going to make the, y'all like my little crepe? That's cute. Very nice. Three bucks at the flea market. We're going to leave that right there. We're going to leave that. Me and Gina going to leave that right there. <laughs> so, do you know what that is? Yes. Yep. We're going to leave that right there. Right there. We're going to leave that right there for Kim. 
But yeah, um, Monday we're gonna make this little pin cut the pin cushion. Oh yeah, that's right. I gotta get my I gotta get my stuff. I gotta I got the cup in there. And if it uh, I can't use it, well, then I got to... thank you. We're gonna make this pin cushion Monday on the lot. So y'all get ready to show everybody else on here who didn't see it. So what you're gonna need to make this? I got my little basket here with all my supplies in it. You're gonna need some fiber fill. Fiber Probably fill, about this much. You're gonna need some yarn of your choice. I'm gonna use this. This is crafter secret too. cotton. I think I got that color too. Mm -hmm. In the color spring stripe. You can read, have read my freaking toilet. Who don't you talk about roll tide, bro? Oh, that's what you think it's stand for. Uh-uh. Chris. Roll, roll mother effing tide. <laughs> You're gonna need something like this to go into the base of it for your storage. Now, this is um the cap from the liquid laundry detergent. So if you have some of these laying around, even if they're dirty, just wash them. Just wash it out. They'll smell good. It's just washing powder. <laughs> That's it. So wash it. You're going to need. And if recommend... you don't have that, tell them, Jenny, if you don't have that. Yeah, if you don't have this, you can use plastic canvas. Or, the... or you can use, well, you can use the ring off of an orange juice container or something. Or you but... have Pringles can if you don't have that, you can use plastic canvas in the bottom of it. But in the top part here, you're going to need. I it, I wouldn't recommend plastic canvas. Does it go if through? If you don't have anything else except for plastic canvas, that is fine. Just cover the plastic canvas with a piece of cardboard. To cover to close the holes up, hot glue a piece of cardboard onto the plastic. Can. <laughs> <laughs> it looks like a <laughs> that's what you put your laundry detergent. Hey, in. I got some drug testing cups at the office. Hmm. That might, that might work. It might it not be. Work. Is it wide enough? Yeah, it's about the same width, but it'd be just a little bit taller. Oh, okay. I'll have to get one and see. But these work good because that's what's in the bottom of here. See? Yeah. peek -a And that houses three <laughs> tape measures. But you could put like your um, needle threader. You could put stitch markers in here. You could put a, a thimble. If you use a thimble when sewing, you could put that in there. And then the top part, if you got plastic canvas and you want to use it, I do recommend that you cover the holes up. Because you want something solid here that's going to stop your pins and stuff from going all the way through. Mm -hmm. And I have this that I've already cut to go in the bottom of mine for Monday. The drug screen cups would be perfect. You know what, Michi? I'll go over there and get one tomorrow and take a picture of it and upload it to the community tab but i mean i don't know who else would have access to it but then i found this piece of cardboard in that crate yeah because you know she's a nurse so that's why i thought she said that well i do our drug test for our company uh oh me she's a nurse too mm -hmm. yeah and this cardboard here is really really thick see mm -hmm. you can use a shoe shoe box if you got an old shoe box yeah so I'm probably going to end up cutting mine out of this one. I'm sure everybody has an Amazon box laying around somewhere. Mm. Yes. And you'll need a button of your choice. I got a button, I think. I got some buttons. I'm going to either use my 4.0 or 3.5 millimeter crochet hook. So one of the two. I'm getting ready for bed, but I want to leave my thumb and send. And you of course, also, you crazy kids stay out of trouble. Okay, Kim, good night. Okay, Kim. How's your she shed coming along? Look, look at this food. What this food said. <laughs> <laughs> Cut.
Chris. The sample cups also come with those little butterfly stickers so you can see if someone tampered with your stuff. <laughs> Hi. Hey Melanie J. Hey Melanie, welcome in. All right, I'm gonna drop down because I gotta go to bed. I'm tired. You too sleepy to pop, huh? Sandrine, five more minutes because I'm going to bed too because I'm okay. tired. Too. Five more minutes. That's good with me because I need to go take a shower. I didn't realize you were still on. That's why okay. I popped in here and came on. But I got all the stuff here ready to go Monday. That's Monday at 6 p.m. Central Standard Time. Hi, Melanie. Bye, Melanie. Bye, everybody. Have a good night. Good night. Hey, Samita. Melanie. Yeah, because me and my husband, we did some walking today. Now change this, change this layout out around. Oh, my bad. Thank you. <laughs> I'm looking for the darn thing down here for me to do it myself. And I'm like, you ain't got the power. <laughs> Iris said it's barely 8.33. Iris, it's 10.33 here, honey. Yeah, she's sleeping. Chris did no cat typing, sorry. <laughs> yeah, because up here he did this right here. Yeah, I watched a little bit of Angie's today on the way to Montgomery. And then when we got out the truck, I had to turn it off because we got um, two free buckets from Harbor Freight today. We get coupons and stuff like that where you can get free stuff. Used to, you had to get a, you had to um, purchase a certain amount of stuff, but they changed it for members because we members, we got a free part, a free bucket with any purchase. So when we was ringing up the stuff, I just had one bucket in the buggy. And the girl said, uh, we're going to put this to the side and you're going to ring it up separately. So y'all can get two buckets. I, I said, that's fine by me. My husband said, good. Now you can leave my bucket alone. <laughs> you know what? I want to get a couple of buckets because I want to, um, I want to plant some. Because if I plant it in the yard, you know, the dogs break the fence and they get in the dog neighbor dog. Mm -hmm. And if I get the buckets and put them on the porch, then I ain't worried about it too much. What you want to plant in? I want to plant cucumbers and tomatoes and, and, uh, well, cucumbers are going to run. Oh, they're going to get big. They'll run over the bucket. Oh, okay. So they need to be in the ground, huh? Yeah. And because when they start putting cucumbers on, then they're going to get heavy and they'll have the potential to break. Oh, okay. Break, you know, break their vine. Yeah. Chris said, just make sure it's legal to plant that stuff. It's legal to plant vegetables. You can plant vegetables. She ain't talking about no puff puff pass. <laughs> I'm going to get my, I'm going to get me a medical call out of that. And I'm going to plant that too. I done lost my roach clips. I don't know what it did with well. <laughs> Yeah, berries. Oh, she said bakeries will give you five gallon buckets. Well, I said come in, just wash them. Oh yeah, I can get them at Publix. Hmm. But oh and yeah, those would be good. To put on, uh, wash them, and put uh scrap balls in. Yeah. I'm sure you they they come with a lid, and then you can they stack. Do. They come with a lid. Yeah. Yeah. We put them up against the wall. I don't know where they went. I had two clips off of the back of flowers. <laughs> Somebody asked me what oh here they are. Somebody asked me what they was. I said Okay, my Christy, good night. <laughs> <laughs> That's sure what they used to do back in the day when it got down to a little, little bit. bit. Mm -hmm. To keep from burning them lips. Look, look, look. Potholders was already taken. <laughs> Thank you, Liddy. I redid all the yarn back there and I put most of it in place. Good night, Mara. I actually have um across the bottom are my wilts that would fit in there. So Yeah, Misha, that's funny. I'm gonna get my medical card. They say you can send off for it for two hundred dollars. Yeah. I'm gonna send off for me one. I need yeah, one. For everybody knows me with glaucoma. I'm getting me one. 
Uh uh, this pain I be having, it helps out with that. Or I'm gonna uh, find me somebody to get something from and start. <sighs> I already, I, mean, I already I already know how to get it, but I just need the card. So I don't police, know. Um, so the police pull me over, like, ma'am, you've been smoking weed. You got a card. Here you go. <laughs> I don't want to not be able to see. <laughs> You'll be able to see, you know, unless you get real high. You get you some edibles. Mm, I'm talking about glaucoma. Oh. But no, these came it, out. Look, yeah, her room is pretty. She did a good job on that room. I got to do mine. And I got it functional to, I don't have, the only thing I have underneath my desk where my sewing machine is sitting on is stuff for sewing. That's it. And it's in little small baskets. I don't have no more yarn sitting here except for that that's sitting on top. Of just don't take pickle buckets. Why you don't take pickle buckets? Because it smells like pickle. Oh, you can clean them out too. Put some baking soda in the water. Or wash them with a little bleach. I keep pickle jars all the time. We drink out of <laughs> Me too. I, uh -uh, I got the big one. I keep the pickle juice because I have leg cramps and stuff. Foot yeah, cramps. Chris, that, that, they say marijuana is good for um, glaucoma. I'm working on a sleeve. Glaucoma, it decreases the pressure. Mine's been 21 every time I go to the eye doctor. And he said if it gets any higher, then he's going to start me on the drops. Hey, those buckets like that would be good to put if you buy big bags of flour and sugar and stuff in, too. Mm -hmm. To keep it in. To keep them in, too. Mm -hmm. You'll never get the smell out of the plastic. Oh, the plastic ones, yeah. I love the pickle. I love the pickle smell. Ms. Margie. I, I, I'm telling y'all, that one, somebody said the other day, Abigail said that she has some yarn to send me for these empty holes. I told her, please don't, babe, because trust me, I got some yarn I could put back in the holes. <laughs> for sure. I don't need anything. I've gone through, and I've got clear totes back here with all my supplies in it. I got one for keychains, one for pacifier holders, one for... um. Uh, bur uh, the little barret clamps that you can make flowers and put on and different stuff like that. Now, it's time for me to get busy and start making stuff. To you need save. to find, you need, and you need to find, you got, you got plastic for your, uh, your fabric, plastic being for your fabric. Oh, yeah. I just put it in that crate for right now, mm -hmm. but I got some um, pla clear plastic totes out there that I'm going to put it in. Because once you start sewing, once you start being there sewing and start making your own bags and stuff, and start sewing, you shoot, you'll see stuff everywhere. I did pretty good. Um, on my first couple of bags. No, I, I do not. I do not want my <laughs> I do not want my flour tasting like pickles. No, no, Jeannie, no. <laughs> Look, no. I like the pickle smell, but I do not. Hi, Pam. Hey, Pam. No, I don't want no plastic pickle bucket. Yeah, no, no, no. I use the bakery bucket on, with the you going icing out. in. Come on. You going out? Nope. Come on. Come what on. she did? Pee pee. Come on. Come on. Come on. <laughs> Jenny, they kicked out the out the room. Come on here. Come on. What she did? PP Jeannie? No. Oh. Look at this mess. I'm about to cut it. You got the cut it. You know my last nerves. That's what she's doing. <laughs> she won't get back there and lay down. She wants to be right up underneath me and she keeps trying to jump up in my lap and oh, okay. Time for her to go. Pam looks like she could be related to Jen. Mm. Yes. Oh, Kanyar. I didn't know Kanyar do this. I thought it was just acrylic yarn. And see, for your rotary blade, you just take this one off. 
and put the new one on. Hey, Zach. Careful, though. And, and I hope I do find my pink and shears that I got. Because the ones I got are like these. Oh, I like them. They're cute. And these... They're the spring, and they cut. They it don't take a lot of pressure to to cut. Good. And my pink and shears were the same way. So I do too. I need to do the same thing, Marge. I got look. I'm telling y'all, I got a closet, totes over here in the bedroom, totes in the craft room. All that need to come. I need to go full circle and redo my room. I'm gonna put some more shelves up first, though. And then you put your rotary blade on there. Those look like one of those old electric knives. They do. It do look like one of them. Yeah, they do remind me of the electric knives. Y'all, them things used to cut through everything. My mom used to have one. And you talking yeah. about fillet some fish? They'll cut through everything. Oh, I wish my. I had one right now. Just, just for the use in the future. Then you switch it out. And you have your rotary blade. And then you just cut across the top of your fabric, fabric. and it puts your holes in there for you. Jenny, mm -hmm. you you want me to tell my sister to tell her uh, father-in-law to uh, to um, bid on you a um, he like to bid on stuff in, on at Tennessee. Hey, hey, OVW. And he like to bid on stuff in Tennessee, and he'll go pick it up because he live close to the line. And then my sister here too. What that thing called? A surgeon. He got me one for thirty, for twenty nine dollars. What's a surgeon do? Yeah, it ain't got to do much work on it. Just put it on, set it what be be setting, and cut it on and let it do its thing. You, you got to watch it for real and that. Oh. Do all the work. It's better than the sewing machine. Hmm. I'm gonna get mine out and show it to you one day. It's in the trunk of the car. I gotta get it out. I need it. I'm gonna get it. I probably get it out tonight after I, before I take a shower because I need to take it out because I got stuff in there. Hey, OVW, I went over to your um your farming channel. <laughs> I saw where that chicken jumped on top of your head. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I gotta go see that. <sighs> One of your chickens jumped on your head, OVW. That okay. was funny. <laughs> a hot mess. It was a baby chick. No, it was a full grown chicken. She had a wrap, she had a wrap on her head. <laughs> and um she was recording and that chicken just jumped right up on the back of her neck. A hot mess. Melanie J, look, she made me this cup. It took me the longest. It took me the longest to figure out who you kept calling OVW the other day. Sister Marcia. Oh, yeah. That, yeah, that name. That Terry. That Terry name. Yeah. Yeah. Look what she said. Hey, Jeannie Boo, that's Clo. He's so crazy. <laughs> <laughs> Close get out my pen. And my grandbaby called me today and asked me, did Tractor Supply still have baby chickens? I said, last time we were in there, they did. She said, well, when you come get me for the summer for a little while, you'll buy me one. <laughs> oh, where y'all going to put it at? Y'all ain't scared of nothing going to eat it up. That's what her papa asked her. She said, where are you going to keep it at? She said, at your house. But where is it? Not in the inside. Look, here she look, here go right there. We carry until he comes home, stead. Yeah, that's who. Cause at first I didn't know who it was, right? Sandrine looks like you are having fun, not with this drawing bar. But uh, yeah, she was. She was. Make sure I subscribe to that channel. Hold on. Yeah, she said she go. Uh, me too. Let me get my phone. Turn it on. I think I'm subscribed to it already. Type in lavender OVW. Ooh. Hey, I took the phone off. Hey, it might be laying on. I am. I like watching Homestead Homes. OVW, I'm going to tell you another one that I think you'll enjoy. Oh, Lord, I did it's called IAG Farms. And the IAG means it's all about God. 
They're in Mississippi. And they are a husband and wife team. She is a part-time professor at the college where they live. And he, they both run the farm, but he homeschools their three boys. And they literally sold their house and moved in a very small camper and built like a barn. And that's where they, that's what they lived in until they, oh, you watch them, Megan and Tim. Yep. Good. I watch them all the time. He went from an ex-con to to, uh, being a minister and helping others and stuff like that and they bought that land that they bought they bought two lots of land they probably have like 15 acres all together whoa the two. Nice. and they bought it without ever seeing it and one of them has a pond on the well, the one that they're living on has a pond and the other one is called the woodlands all right yeah i like watching homesteaders yeah, but you know, a lot of um, I tried to be a homesteader myself, but my husband too lazy. Hi, Shonda. I wanted some pigs, I wanted some chickens, and all that kind of stuff because I love fresh eggs. And OVW gathered up a whole bunch out there. She, her, on she, that she, video, she gave them to her neighbors. Me. She gave them to her neighbors because she got so many of them. She would sell them. Yeah, I like watching them. I, and it's a um, man and woman out of Georgia that I watch, too. Homestead Heart, I think, is what, they call, what they're what they called. Let me look them up. I Lisa think she wants some goats. Oh, I wanted them, too. Well, them things stink too bad. They stink, they stink worse than pigs. Yeah, Homestead Heart. That lady right there gives you some valuable information. Yes, that's them. She know about them too. Yeah. See, I wanna, I wanna, I wanna plant me some cucumbers, some, some, some watermelons, some, some. Uh, she cans butter tomatoes, that has a five-year life, uh, shelf life on it. Some corn. Now I know I had to plant, plant the corn in the yard. No goats. I have sheep. See, she got sheep. Them look like Mayflowers. May pop I'm subscribed to her. Yep. Yeah. Get you some goat soap, VW, and then you can make goat soap. Yeah. We love goat soap. Sandrine. Goats are cute, but dang, they stink. They stink worse than pigs. They the stinkiest animal, I think. Goats they are only cute. Goats are only cute as kids. When they get grown, they ugly. <laughs> they yell the billy goats they tore up <laughs> but as the kid they're cute yeah miss h she shows you how to can and preserve stuff too she she i just saw a thing on there where it says how to do butter with a five-year shelf life oh really mm-hmm. i need cholesterol free butter but they they will keep your weeds and grass down. Yeah, they will eat your, your weeds and your grass. But so will horses and uh cows. <laughs> I had goats. I had to get rid of them. They were jumping all over the cars. <laughs> they'll bust the, they'll bust the car too. No they'll bust the car up. too. When my na- when my neighbor was still alive. Before her husband shot and killed her, they had a bunch of goats. Corn and squash and beans around the stalk, the corn stalk. Oh, okay. And they, um, he was part of the Tuskegee University, um, with the goat farm and stuff. They would come out and do, um, do a seminar, uh, some kind of thing at, down there. And we, I used to go to it all the time. He learned a whole lot about goats, but he had a lot of African goats. Um, that's like worth a lot of money. Mm-hmm. Goats. And they when he shot and killed Mary, 
they claim he shot and killed himself up there at his best friend's funeral home. But I don't know. If, we don't know if he's dead or not because you can't find no obituary or nothing on him online anywhere. Mm. Look what OBW said. Good, OBW, good. But yeah, um, they had a bunch of goats and she was the primary caretaker of those goats. And when she would need to catch them to give them their medicine and worm them and all that kind of stuff, she normally would call me to come down there and help her. And you had some of them them uh, male goats. They them mugs drop that head and, and scratch that front foot and get ready to come towards you. Yeah, well. And they had some beautiful, one of them had twins and they were so beautiful. She actually put them in a show and won from them. Mm -hmm. She had a couple that she would do for show goats. And she had started making goat soap. And goat cheese. Or well, did it with their milk. From the milk and stuff, yep. But he had to go and kill her. Mm -mm -mm. And then put her in the trunk of her car and drove it in the woods back there. Mm -mm -mm. And then left, got the girls and her two girls saw it. Oh, happen. you talking about the lady, cro the man, this stuff across the street. Yeah, that's so sad. Yeah, that's yeah a sad you, can, story. You, can look, you can look it up. It's uh, only thing you got to do is type in Mary Timmons, T I M M O N S Scott. She said, What's the name of the channel? What channel? You got two Homestead Heart and I.A.G um, farms. It's all about God. Here's Homestead Heart. I'll drop their link. I know Sandrine don't mind. Uh -uh. Okay. This is Homestead Heart's link. I mean, she teaches you a whole lot. Uh, especially on canning and preserving and stuff like that. Hey, Miguel. Hey, Miguel. And then I'll get IAGs too. I dot A dot G. Yep, goat soap. Yeah, goat soap. Goat soap is good. My husband loves it. They sell it in the store, but I don't think it's authentic as it is as if you get it from the paper person who make it. We can get it from our drugstore here from a local goat farm farmer. Oh, okay. So this is I A G Farms. And the IAG stands for It's All About God. And and I got to watch it. I hadn't watched it yet. But um, they just released a video where he's telling his story from ex-con to a homesteader and all that kind of stuff. But they, they go around and do ministry within the prisons and stuff like that. Mm -hmm. Yes, Kim. Goat soap. Jenny, can you hear this boy snore? Mm, I hear him breathing hard. Goat milk. It's called goat milk soap. We just, my husband literally just paid $17 and something for one freaking bar from Alta. Whoa. Because Marshalls didn't have what they had that we bought to try. And if your That's feet were rough, you could wash your feet with that soap and that'd be so smooth. I was I was at a store. We oh uh, you might need to try the African Americans hair stores. Yeah, they might have some here in South. I think I see drugstore. One of our local, uh, like mom and pop drugstores called Carter's. They have a lady that has a goat farm, and she makes it, and they sell it in their store. I think I seen some in that. Yep. Look, I went and got I went and got me a ponytail right. It's gonna be like this. It's gonna look like this. Uh huh. When I put it on tomorrow, and when I went in there, I swear I seen some goat soap and some black Af Af the black soap. Oh, Michi, y'all do goat soap? See? He would, he would love it, honey. He gonna be like, kiss, kiss Michi for me. 
can kiss him in his lips. <laughs> no, kid, you to kiss me, Chief. Oh. Okay. <laughs> Miguel, where is she from? I've been watching a retired science teacher in Alabama that has cooking channel. She has cookbooks published in a house she rents out for lodgers and cooks for them. What? Kim, goat milk soap is so wonderful. And most of it, you can get it with fragrances. The lady that sells it in the local... um drugstore here she does it in different fragrances or you can get it with no fragrance she even has a baby line product out for babies mm. next time i go oh did i see that public next time i go in public i'm gonna look for that goat milk soap and i'm gonna send you a picture of it we got tuskegee we got tuscaloosa Tuscaloosa is where Sandrine is, and then Tuskegee is um we got what Tallapoosa? Yeah, we got Tallapoosa, we got yeah. Talladega. Talladega. Yes, acne line. Well, we don't have problems with acne. Mm -mm. Yes. Vivian said, I know a lady that used goat soap and lotion while she was going through chemo and radiation. You couldn't tell she had radiation. Hey, Mama oh. Jay Way. Hey, Mama Jay Way. Dang. Who knows Brenda Gant? Where's she from, Sandra? She lives where Sandrine is. Oh, she lives in Tuscaloosa. Mm. Cooking mm -hmm. with Brenda Gant. Cooking with Brenda Gant. Oh. I'm going to have to look her up. I've been saying we got to look her up. <laughs> to look her up now. Yeah, I need to try that goat soap. You want me to highlight her name? You got it. <clears throat> Fried green tomatoes. Lord, I know how to cook fried green tomatoes now. Who don't? Andalusia, Alabama. She lives in Andalusia. Oh, she lives in Andalusia. Oh, you got a T. That's a A. Hey. What else she cook? I watched that video tonight. Oh, he watched it tonight. Fried oh, she do live in Tuscaloosa. Linda Grant lives in Tuscaloosa. She lives live in Andalusia. She lived in Tuscaloosa. She probably retired from the University of Alabama. Alabama. Oh, okay. She lived in Tuscaloosa. Now she lives in uh, Andalusia. <clears throat> Cream okay. cheese grits. This is not just oh, I learned about cheese cream cream cheese grits from actually Steve Harvey. Mm. You know he he loves southern cooking. <laughs> you put cream cheese in your grits. Oh my god! It I heard makes, about that too. It makes them creamy and gives them a different taste. And oh, they're they're delicious. Smother fried chicken. Fried chicken smothered in gravy. That's my mama's specialty. <laughs> oh, mine too. My mom. My mom. Mm. Pot roast with gravy. I'm going to see what she's about. Mustard and turnip greens. Now I'm going to have to watch and see how she do hers. I ain't found nobody yet to cook them. She like did, Miguel. Miguel, she lived, in, she lived in Tuscaloosa, but she moved to oh, well, what it was in. Andalusia. Oh, I've watched this lady before. She published three cookbooks. Yeah, I've, I've watched her before. She was a high school science teacher. Okay. Okay. The Cobble House. Okay. All right. I'm going to roll you over, Aiden. 
It said it's been months since I bought the book, How to Scam People Online. It still hasn't turned up. <laughs> <laughs> See, she cooked like I cook. She said some kind of greens, pork chops, macaroni and cheese, cornbread, and candy ham. That's a meal. That's a meal. That's how I cook. Pork chops, little macaroni and cheese, and cornbread. That is all you need. The only other thing I can think of is maybe little. <laughs> Green onions to go with it. I like to eat green onions. Uh, give me some raw onion chopped up with my greens. Honey, I cook smothered pork chops and tomato gravy. It ain't nothing like no good night, Pam. Good <laughs> old and I might have to I might have to cook that one day for y'all and show y'all. That's just a smothered fried and pork chop with mashed potatoes and collard greens. That's a meal too. Girl, you gotta get you some grits, girl. Yeah. And see, I put I put vinegar in my greens. Oh yeah. Yes, yes, yes. I fry me some good old bacon. Add me just a tad of water to it when it gets the the, the crispiness that I want it. Add my salt, my pepper, and and then I add my greens and let them cook down. <laughs> Then I add my Me too, Ola Joe. <laughs> little vinegar to them, and I throw mm -hmm. in two little peppers, the trapeze peppers that you buy in the jar. I throw mm -hmm. two of them in there. No, mm -hmm. Andalusia, Andalusia's not that far from us. i tell you how far I am from Andalusia. If I had my phone, I would tell you how far I am. I'll look, you, I'll look it up for you, too. But it, it fell on the floor. Aiden laid on it. Or, I don't know what it Andalusia was. is. She's going to be about 200 miles from Sandrine. She's 103 from me. Oh, she's closer to you. Mm -hmm. She's down Look. there um, south of Mackenzie. We're making everybody home. I'm going to eat me some cereal when I get out here. Well, I just ate some Salisbury. My husband cooked homemade Salisbury steak yesterday with actual steak. Mm -hmm. She's 176 miles from you, Sandra. Oh, okay. And, um, but if you, how many of y'all have never had tomato gravy? I never had it. Well, well, I probably had it, but don't know what it is. Tomato gravy is the bomb. You can take and make some good old fresh. <laughs> That's what she gonna be dreaming about food. You can you can go in and make some fresh homemade biscuits and just cook you up some tomato gravy. And when you get them biscuits out the oven, open them up and spread some butter on top of them enough that it don't melt all the way. And then put that tomato gravy on top of them. Oh my god. Sandra said it is good. Yes. My mama used to cook it all the time. I'm going to have to ask mom and dad they know about tomato gravy. All of Joe's going to be in you fall in July. We'll let y'all know. You how far better, is it away? You better. How far is it away, uh, Jeannie? I'm going to tell you how far it is from you. I'll meet you at Gina. I'll meet at Gina. How many Gina drive from there? Uh, 187 miles. You followed you around the other side of Burm uh, Montgomery. Oh, okay. Well, ain't no, that ain't bad. And for me, one hundred thirty-two hours, twenty-seven minutes. Oh, baby, I'll be there with bells on, honey. Me too. You follows Dreaming. north of Dothan. Oh, okay. Dreaming of <laughs> what Chris said. Dreaming of being in a mashed potato igloo and eating my way out with a bucket of gravy. <laughs> Kim, tomato gravy is really good. It's easy to make. You make it like you're going to do just regular brown gravy. 
Yes, Miguel. We finna get off in a minute. And then once you get, once your flour, your paste gets brown, you can use, I like using the petite diced tomatoes in the can. But if I have fresh tomatoes, I use fresh tomatoes. But I use the petite diced tomatoes in the can. Once my paste gets brown, I pour them in there and mix them up with the paste and kind of let them kind of just sizzle just a little bit. Then you add your water to it. And it is so good. Fry you some pork chops and put them over in there and eat them on a eat it with a with rice. Mm, I've tried it. Holla Joe, you're not two hours from me. You won't be two hours from me, honey. So yes. Yes, yes. Let me know. I'll drive to Gina House and we'll leave from Gina House and keep it trucking. Because she don't stay that far from me. You know if I can drive to Georgia and Mobile, that ain't nothing. We are driving so we may have to pass y'all. Where are you going, Ola Joe? Because you might be coming through. Yep, you might be coming through. Pass us past us and we might can get a little bit closer than you follow mm -hmm. even if we don't do nothing pull over side of the road and get out and get a big old hug <laughs> and take a couple of pictures <laughs> i ain't never i don't i don't care for milk gravy Oh, you're going to you follow. No, you'll drop you'll drop down through Georgia and come you'll come south. You follow's more south of us. You follow's not too far from the Georgia line. But because we're in central Alabama, we're not too far from you follow either. Honey, we'll come to you follow and see you to let us know what day. Yes, and do a quick live. Yes, ma'am. We'll, we'll be hid in the bushes and then we'll jump out. <laughs> Don't do that. Might get shot. <laughs> <laughs> might get shot. You got family and you follow all of Joe? I could have been through with this thing if the jar hadn't been tangled up. Centering, you don't do nothing go in Montgomery and catch 231 and run straight down. Like going to Dothan. No problem. We're talking about you follow Alabama. Uh, Michi, she said you follow Oklahoma. It's close to me. <laughs> we got quite a few YouTubers in Alabama. We got Trace, uh, What's her name? Tra is it Tracy from I Love Loopy Crochet and Treasures? I don't know her. She's up there in Reform, Alabama. Oh, just Lord. right right above you. Mm -hmm. Good night, Rochelle. Rochelle, Good night, Rochelle. You to, you don't forget you're going to Joanne's now. <laughs> oh, I know, Rochelle. Don't forget you're going to Joanne's tomorrow. Um, we got Kim. Kim She's yeah. right at the Georgia-Alabama line. We got Ivy. East of Birmingham toward Georgia line. You got family in Montgomery too? Wow. And then we got, we got, um, you said Ivy, then we got, um, yeah, we got Ivy in Montgomery. We got Felicia. Felicia in Montgomery. In Montgomery. Look. You know you're going there. I ain't on these tribes. You're going, you're going to go in. Come there and going back to our roots. Ooh, Ola Joe, that is wonderful. If y'all go to Montgomery, well, y'all be right there by. Ola Joe, I'm not 50 miles from Montgomery. And it don't take me no. It, it take me about an hour to get to Montgomery. I can get there in about 30 minutes. Sure, me too. <laughs> <laughs> they tell me, how, how, how long it take you to get to Birmingham? 45 minutes. Mm -mm. Birmingham. I can get Birmingham in an hour and fifteen minutes from Selma. My mama, I mean, my sister say it take my sister say it take her. 
Cindy Suttle, she's in Reform, Alabama. She's more closer to the Mississippi line on the west side my, of Alabama. My sister say it take a, for, to, from my house to her house, it take an hour, hour, 45 minutes. Baby, no, Cindy day, Suttle, Cindy Suttle. One day I got mean. home in, a, in an hour. It's supposed to be an hour, 45 minutes. I drove She's 80 North miles Alabama. the whole way. I was, I was rolling. Yeah. Cindy Suttle, she's North Alabama. Well, all of Joe's folks are from Montgomery, Alabama. From Alabama. They roll with the tide. Hmm. And that's in July. I'm going to Memphis in August. They had the family reunion in Birmingham. I'm 98 miles from Birmingham. Baby, I can get to Birmingham. They say they say 45 minutes, but not me. I can get there. You can get up there on 2059 and and get down with the best of them, baby, and just keep on trucking. <laughs> I'm rolling with the traffic. If the traffic getting it, I'm going to be right behind and the traffic. jump off wherever you need to jump off at. That's right. Got to hit it, baby. Well, Ola Joe, I'll email you my phone number. Yes. Tell us when you go out in the month of uh, Birmingham. And or you follow either one. It don't matter. Yeah. We will be there. I tell you. Yeah. But well, we about to tell y'all bye bye on this live because the sister got to get up at five a.m. Yeah, and I'm finna go to bed. I got to get up at five a.m. and I got to go to bed and I got a three hour drive ahead of me. Cause we might get up in the morning and go help the neighbors if it don't rain. Yeah. So. Well, well, thank you for having me. You but welcome. yes, Holly Joe, please don't come this close, so close that I can smell you and you can smell me. Without us seeing you, honey. How far are you two apart? How Miguel, far we are an hour. We are, I think I'm 87 miles from Sandrine. I go to Tuscaloosa to get my car service because that's where I bought it at, at the Hyundai place in Tuscaloosa. So I take my car up there to get serviced. And every time I go, Sandrine comes and picks me up and we go shopping and eat out and stuff like that. So, yeah. Yep. Me and Sandrine has met several times. Yeah, we had first time we met was during the height of COVID. Yep, we did. Um, and I took her all those boxes of yarn. Yes, all my Red Heart Super Saver. It was like six big boxes. Of Susan Burke, good night. I good night, Miss Susan. <laughs> yep. Yeah. So me and Sandrine, we've met and shopped and ate out and stuff like that already. Yep. Next time I go though, we'll have to just pop, do a pop up live. That's the last time we went. That's when our wig flew off her head. <laughs> it was real windy. <laughs> yeah. It sure did. It flew it's right off my head. Don't even jump down. Okay, y'all. Can't make, wait to meet you either. Uh, Me Ola either, Joe. Ola Joe. I can't wait to meet you either. Good night, all. Good night.